Hey everyone, Fyro here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do, make roofs like this that curve out to meet your towers and things. So, how do we start? Right. Here's a copy of my wall. All we do, take a line tool, get a nice big size, and I'm going to go into tweak mode, and you line it up with where you want it to meet the wall. And you want to make sure you've got a reasonable amount on this side as well. So click OK there. Tweak mode again. Bring it up so it's level with the top. Bring it across till it's green. Then you want to push it along so this meets whatever height you're building your wall to. I've just taken a section to the top. Make sure it's actually in the right position. Just hit OK. And then we'll undo that. We'll change our material to something else. And try it again. Bring up the bottom. Bring up the top. And then just take to the wall. So yeah, different material so you can actually see what you're working with. Right, so what we want is this bit here. What we don't want is the wall and all this rubbish. This side. So how do we get rid of it? So, start with, I'm going to take the copy of the curve I used for the wall. Turn it around so it's facing the same direction. And then I'm going to place it one off the ground. Now I want to move the remove the smoothing of this so I can see where the voxels are. So just to do that, select the area underneath it and delete it. So it all moves out like that. Then back to select the tool. Drag it above to the top, then add into the box, and then delete it. Now you can see all the voxels are square. And then we do make a nice big area somewhere that would originally have been below ground. Too deep and heal it. And we want to make a copy of this in the healed earth by painting. So, two, three, done this a few times as you may have noticed and I still get it wrong right after you've done it check for so it's square and then you want to line it up with your shape hold F and if you it all disappears you've made it right right back to the paint tool I also want to move everything within the center of the curve so just going to paint all this area on the inside of the curve as well. Okay, once we've done that, select the whole shape. Come over to your wall with the line tool and go into tweak mode and just line this up. 
with your circle or your curve of the wall. That looks about right. Then we're going to select the remove voxels option and just remove it slice by slice. Now because this is painted in healed earth it's going to remove the voxels that are there but it won't change the shape of anything. It's done. Escape out of that, and you see nice curved wall section. And just copy that out. Paste it in the air. Bring it three down. Hold F and delete. There we go. <coughs> and if we've all done this right, this should fit in the copy of the wall I have behind. Into tweak mode again to line it up. Nope. Uh, nope. And there we go. Now this edge can just be copied out and used to extend the wall that way. You will get some sort of texture marks here. It's actually the, the stucco texture causing the problem, not the, there is no distortions there, just the texture. So some textures will work better than others for your walls. But even that, it's only when it's in bright, very bright light. And the whole thing does render really quite well from a distance as well, keeping the shape. So I hope that helps anyone. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.